Hello, everybody. Uh, welcome to my channel. This might be a bad idea. I don't know. You know, though. You know from the title. You know because the video will already be made while you're watching this. But as of now, I have no idea what's going to happen. Basically, I want to give myself baby lights to retouch my roots. They aren't even that bad, but it really bothers me, like, up in here, like, face framing. Because I kind of have, like, a red reddish hair that's also brunette and blonde at the same time it's just gross it looks puby it looks really puby i just you know this morning i woke up and i was just like hey i need to fix my roots i don't want to go to the salon i don't want to pay 300 dollars and five hours out of my day to get my roots done so why don't i just go to sally beauty and get some stuff and do it myself. Sounds like a great time. It sounds like an awesome time, honestly. I've seen all the bleach gone wrong videos. Uh, if this ends up on a Brad Mondo video, I'm gonna cry and fall and throw my body into the sun. I don't really know what I need. Um, I know I definitely need like bleach and a toner. I'm honestly hoping that the worker at Sally Beauty knows what I need. Uh, if not, we're gonna have a bit of a problem, but it's fine. We'll deal with it later. Yeah. Also, just to say, if it wasn't obvious enough, I have absolutely no experience bleaching my hair or doing anything with my hair. But we're gonna do it anyway. It's a cold day in Canada. Yes. The guy at Sally Beauty, oh my God, he was so nice. He was so nice to me. He asked me if I knew what I was doing. I lied. I said yes. He knew I lied. And he set me up with everything that I need. So, uh, Sally Beauty haul. First, we got a brush with a very fine end thing. And then I got a bowl. I know this is kind of unnecessary. I was just going to use one of my food bowls. That I, then I figured, oh, like bleach in my food bowl like i don't know if i trust that so i got an actual color bowl it's very cute it's purple i love it so he said get a kit of things uh this is be bleach please bleach please bleach please i got a toner in very life blonde and then i believe this is developer Okay, I've thoroughly read the instructions and <sighs> Okay, I have changed my shirt into this old thrifted shirt. I'm assuming someone got from like a Mexican restaurant. I'm not afraid if I get bleach on it. I barely ever wear it, but wearing it now, it's actually super comfortable. I kind of like it, but let's ruin it anyway. So basically, I'm mixing all this together. Do I need this much? No, probably not. It's just my roots, but I'm gonna use it all. I got my hair done in August and my hair grows stupid, stupid, stupid fast. And so my roots are always just like, just all over the place. And uh, I doubt I'll ever do this again. If I do, I'll get a new kit. I won't use this much, but just to be safe, I wanna use all of it. Ow. Let's get to bleaching and mixing and let's just start! Bleach, please. Oh my god, it's filling up the entire bowl. Is that allowed? Is that okay? Of course, of course it has one of these stupid little cap things. It's not coming out very easily. Ugh. I'm not even joking. That took 20 minutes to get this all out of the bottle and I had to cut it and I don't even think I got all of it out of the bottle. This is already not worth it. No, it's gonna be worth it. It's gonna be worth it. I found a old plastic Tupperware container that no one uses, hopefully. Um, oh. This is getting everywhere. This is stupid. Guys, I hate this. I don't wanna go my whole life scared of bleaching my own hair so 
you know what, we're breaking down walls, we're breaking through fears, we are activating our life. So I'm kind of going to work with this top section, this stupid stuff underneath that I absolutely don't care about at all. I'm going to tie back. Let's get some bleach. Yeah, this is a good idea. This is such a good idea. I know it. I feel it in my soul. Sectioning is in commence. Now with the video I watched, she kind of worked from left to right. So that's that's what I'm going to do. We'll see how that works for me. Okay, I think this is like a good section of where like I want to start kind of. All right, now for baby lights, I don't know if you'll be able to really see what I'm doing. If This is not a tutorial, by the way. Do not follow what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm doing. Don't do it. That's how I seen them do it in the salon. So that's how I'm gonna do it. So I'm taking some bleach. You don't wanna get it too close to the root. And also you wanna keep it What? Oh, my foil fell. It's not horribly going horribly, horribly wrong. Here I've got my next little section, if you can hear me or over the tin foil. Okay. Good. Okay, I'm gonna keep going. This is hard. Right, time lapse time. So basically, yeah, I just kept doing my hair with the foils. Um, during the middle of this, my phone ran out of storage and stopped the time lapse. So you don't see the whole thing and it kind of jumps ahead to me with all the foils in because you have to be fast with bleach and I didn't have time to delete things on my phone so I could keep filming because I think your hair can like come off fall out or something and I didn't want that to happen but this was hard my arms were hurting and it took a very very long time it's going pretty well actually I had to take the foils out on this side because it's like ready it's done it's pretty blonde. It's a little bit yellow, but I think the toner will fix that. Um, this, I did a little bit thick. Um, you know, it really says I did my hair at home and that shows integrity. That shows I have patience. That shows that I'm a go-getter at her doer person. So, um, but basically I have to wash this out. These ones are still, going a bit longer they're still a bit too yellow so let's see is this one ready to do maybe this one is I can take out a foil with you guys oh yeah that one's ready you see I'm gonna wash the bleach off and like dry my hair and we'll come back and put on the toner What have I done? It is pretty yellow. In here, like very brassy. Up here, very brassy. Um, in here is good. In here is good. In here is fine. I'm wondering if I maybe didn't leave the bleach on for long enough. I'm really hoping this comes to the rescue and saves me this toner. Cause if not, I'm gonna have to go to the hair salon. Skunk vibes. Why is this so white? <laughs> What's going on again? Oh no! <laughs> it's definitely very yellow. Just to say this is a bad idea. If you think you can bleach your own hair and you have no experience, uh, you can't, don't do it. Okay, I need to blow dry and then put this shit in immediately. Immediately, I need to fix this. I need to fix this now. Okay, so I am mixing my developer. It's a one-to-one -one ratio. On the instructions, it says to do it on dry hair, dry and wash hair. 
but I was just watching a video and it said if like you just bleached your hair, you can use a to toner developer on wet hair. I have way too much bleach, so I'm gonna be really meticulous of where I put this because some of the spots are already really light and don't need it as much as some other spots. Woohoo! Terrible, terrifying. I am scared for my life. What is my mom gonna think? Is my dad gonna hate me? Am I gonna get kicked out of the house? What is my hairdresser gonna do if I show up to her like this? She's gonna hate me. She's gonna be like, girl, what the hell were you thinking? And I'm gonna be like, yep, you were right. I'm a dumbass. Sorry. Just lather it. Just absolutely lather that shit. <laughs> what do I do? A part of my brain was like, I hope it turns out like shit because that would be really good content. Well, it did, so. Is it bad? Yes. Is it terrible? Mm, that's for you to decide. I'm just panicking at this point. I need someone to help me, whether it's Brad Mondo, whether it's Jenna's Ratchet Salon. I just need some help. Please? Anyone. <laughs> Why do I sound like Sarah Paulson? <laughs> oh my god, don't give me a cupcake. I don't want a cupcake. Uh. Okay, so it's definitely starting to look a little better. A little bit. Um, from this toner and developer. It's only been about three minutes. Moment of truth. Did the toner help my hair at all? Actually, a little bit. It actually did. I'm gonna explain what I think happened because the sides here look really good. They turned out perfect. Um, I think I didn't leave the bleach for long enough at the top of my head. Also, I think I did too thick of sections at the top of my head, but it definitely doesn't look like a skunk lives on the top of my head anymore, which I'm pleased about, but I'm going to let my hair dry and then we will see if I should bleach it again. Oh yeah. Um, as for the feeling of my hair, it feels fine. It feels how it did exactly before I bleached it. Um, I've had no fallout or anything, but I'm I'm good with this. Like if, if it's dry and it looks fine, like I'm not gonna bleach it again. Um, but since it's such little sections, I think I could get away with bleaching it again. I'm gonna wait for it to dry, but I'm okay with this actually. This is not, horrible and yeah it's it's fine i also used a bit of purple shampoo in the shower as well i'm not sure if that did anything i'm sure it helped a little bit but yeah it's definitely still yellow up there <laughs> my hair's dried so i don't know what that toner did but it worked a miracle <laughs> I don't know what happened, but this is not bad at all. Like, I'm actually quite pleased with this. It is a little yellow on the top. It is a little yellow. It's a little brassy, but like not bad at all. Um, I think if I left the bleach on there, like for an extra five minutes, it would have been perfect. The sides look amazing, like all in here is nice and blonde now and like the sideburn piece that I hate so much when it gets super grown out is like blonde. It looks really good. I'm gonna take you guys into some natural light because I haven't seen my hair in the natural light yet, so we will go do that. Here is the hair in the natural light. Is it a little yellow on the top? Yes. A little bit but it's not bad it's not bad at all and the sides look so good whatever that toner did like literally god answered my prayer because after i took that towel off after the bleach i was honestly scared that i have to go to the salon what do you think she don't care about hair she just wants belly rubs thank you guys for watching um brad mondo what do you think <laughs> All right, bye.